how do you prepare yourself to receive? Well, first you need to believe. You need to believe. If you don't believe it's out there for you, the career, uh, the change, the relationship, the creativity, the breakthrough, if you don't believe, you don't make it impossible, but you make it a lot harder. You gotta be hard a lot harder to spot it. When you do spot it, to, to see it for what it is, the opportunity it is. So there's belief, there's working on belief. I think there's also something to be said for, you know, some people talk about deserving, to believe you are deserving of it. I think deserving is like a dog chasing its own tail. I think in the short term, psychologically, emotionally, there might be some benefits to the notion of deserve. I am deserving, I deserve it, I've worked so hard. For me, existentially in the long run though, it's a boat that doesn't float or can't carry much, much more weight than a feather. I don't believe we deserve. I think it's more random. I don't think it's the universe. I think the universe responds to commitment because I think you make your reality, you make your day. In that regard, maybe believing you deserve can help you receive and create. But deserve has this notion, what I don't like about deserve is if you deserve it, does that mean someone else doesn't deserve it? Does everybody deserve equally? It seems inherently comparative or measurement based somehow. And that stuff uh, is, yeah, it's got a lot, of, uh, a lot of thorns on that flower if you're not careful. So there's belief receive mindfulness you know when something does come your way it's so important to acknowledge it you need to be able to see that it's it's important to to acknowledge it to be aware of it to honor it you know when you want something comes your way when in this crazy storm of a world this whirlwind when something between what's going on around you and what's going on inside you when uh, this wonderful thing almost magically appears, falls into your immediate reality, like an unexpected letter falling through a slot in a mailbox, except you didn't even know there was a slot in the wall over there. You know, you didn't, it's a total surprise. I think it's key to be grateful for that. Not just in the moment, but I think that's also important around receiving more. Now, if you do it in the spirit of I want more, I want more, that's another thing, but I think honoring it, it fuels belief. I also think that like invisible gravity, I think there are eddies and flows and tendencies in the world and the energy in some sense. And this is why, you know, when so many people talk about positive attitude and being attracted to certain energies, this is akin to that kind of belief that things aren't a pure blank page moment to moment, that there are momentums established and I think when you honor something that falls regarding receiving and when you honor that I think that's important so believing honoring when it happens when or rather when you experience it because it might be happening all around you exploding all around you it's a whole other thing for you to see it there's also something to be said for working for things the experience of working for things. I am not sure, you know, I'm reminded again of this notion, and I cite this all the time, all the time. C.S. Lewis, prayer doesn't change God, prayer changes me. So humans, not all of us, but a lot of us are wired that I think if we work towards something, if we do something um, as a habit, uh, again and again, we do something, we put our mind towards something, I think it influences at least, you know, I don't know if it experiences the world beyond ourselves. I'm not even sure what that is. But our own experience of a thing. So when we work towards something, when we strive, when we reach, when we dare to reach, knowing there are no guarantees. And in fact, some people wake up with a sense of absolute disempowerment. So there's no relationship for them between their actions and outcomes. And what a profound, and if you believe that, well, there's a great something, great example of something that can uh, all but guarantee those heartbreaking outcomes. I really appreciate you spending some time with me today. If you enjoyed the video, please 
click the like button and subscribe now.